Hello everyone and welcome to this Simple Shell project. Before we dive into the code, I want to emphasize that this video is purely for educational purposes. We'll be exploring how to approach this project and make it more understandable with proper file naming and comments. First and foremost, let's talk about file naming. You have the freedom to name your files in a way that makes sense to you. However, there are two files that must remain unchanged shell h and main c these files have specific roles in our project and renaming them may cause issues now let's address the absence of comments in the code indeed there are no comments in the code provided however this should not discourage you from adding comments to your code commenting is crucial for understanding the logic and functionality of the code if you omit comments in your submission you may not receive full credit for your project now let's get to work. Let's rename the files as we see fit like it's showing on my screen. In your case, making them more descriptive is essential. Thoroughly study the code and add comments that comply with the Betty Lint standards. Betty Lint is a tool that helps maintain consistent coding style and improves code readability. By writing these comments, we'll gain a deeper understanding of how each piece of code is functioning, which is essential for successful software development. So, let's turn this code into a well-documented and user-friendly project. Remember, the ultimate goal is to learn and improve our coding skills. I hope you found this learning project helpful and insightful. If you enjoyed the content and found it beneficial, please consider giving it a thumbs up and leaving a comment below. Your feedback is incredibly valuable to us, and it helps us create better and more engaging content in the future. If you want to stay updated with our latest videos and projects, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. By subscribing, you'll be part of our growing community of learners, and you'll never miss out on any new exciting content we have in store. Also, if you have any questions or suggestions for future projects, feel free to let us know in the comments. We love hearing from our audience and appreciate your active participation in our learning journey. Thank you once again for watching, liking, commenting, and subscribing. Your support means the world to us. Until next time, keep coding, keep learning, and see you in the next video.